Hey guys, Supreme Tuft here with another Lego Transformer. So here we have Bull. Now, Bull is Mind Mender's turret, but he just has some slight modifications so he can have a third mode as long as. and the fact that his turret mode has longer guns and weapons. So I just thought I'd do a little video on this just to show you. Now, for a size comparison, here he is with stripes, and as you can see, they're basically the same size other than stripes f front of the cannon, but bull is a lot larger in width-wise, and here he is with the comparison dread. I did not make this another version of it. So, uh, yeah, I just thought I'd tell you that quickly. Yeah. So, for one last comparison, here is with a little ship I made that I'll be showing off in a later video. And yeah. Now, he is based off of the same mechanic as... Mindbender's turret of how these fold down and they become the arms, but other than that and the fact that these are longer, it's basically the same. So we'll get him into his second mode, which is a anti-air tank. To get to that, what you want to do is bring the handle down about that far, just for clearance, along with these two pieces. Then you want to bring the feet down. Then you want to make sure if you do have this on a uh, swivel, uh, one by or a two by two swivel, that it's aligned. And then you just want to bring the guns down, bring the feet back down, and you can bring these down as well. Then you just can put this however you want. I like to have it as like a back ski for balance. And then you can do whatever you want with these little guns. And here he is in his anti-aircraft gun mode. So yeah, I just thought that this was pretty cool because these could be like the treads. And you got the giant guns and this could be like the command station. But yeah. So, for size comparisons, here he is with stripes. And yeah, he does kind of decompact a little bit. That makes him a lot wider. Here he is with the comparison dread. I know it is kind of hard to see because it's black on black, but... Yeah. And here he is with the ship. But yeah, so that's pretty much it for this mode. So, to get him into robot mode, what you want to do is just bring the feet down. Bring these two pieces up first. And you just want to actually, do, you want to bring these back. Bring this piece up and then just rotate it so it's level with the 2x2 two two hinge. And then you can just bring these down. You can put the arms wherever you want, but... Here you go, here you have Bull in his robot mode. So, he is a lot... In his robot mode, he is basically the same as Mindbender's turret. Except for the fact that his feet are longer and his arms are longer and the head. But yeah, so for a size comparison, here he is with stripes. And yeah. Here he is with the comparison droid, version 2. And lastly, here he is with the little ship. So, yeah. So, for articulation, his arm, his arms can do a full 360. They can go back that far forward that far. Just move his arms out of the way quickly. His feet can go back that far and forward that far. His head is kind of just one big chunk 
So you could just lift it back that far and forward that far, but if you wanted to, you could just bring these pieces up separately. But yeah, so a quick little note is that his tur his arms are just a uh, giant, not a tile, but like a rod with the little piece right here that blocks halfway of it, but yeah. And there's just three little cylinders, one by one cylinders on the edges. But yeah, so if you do build this, please be sure to give me credit. But also be sure to give my vendor credit if you build his version. I will leave a link in the description to his channel, so I recommend you go check it out because he makes a lot of cool stuff. But thanks for watching.